Tilapia is the common name for nearly a hundred species of cichlid fish native to Africa and the Middle East. Tilapia are mainly freshwater fish inhabiting shallow streams, ponds, rivers, and lakes, and less commonly found living in brackish water. Traditionally, they have been of major importance in small-scale, low-technology fishing in Africa, and they are becoming increasingly important today in aquaculture and aquaponics. The aquaculture of Nile tilapia goes back some 4,000 years to ancient Egypt, and glyphs of tilapia are painted on their tomb walls. Tilapia were also one of the principal types of fish caught in the Sea of Galilee. Today, tilapia have been introduced throughout the world and are now farmed in over 135 countries, with China being the largest producer. There are three main species of tilapia currently being farmed for consumption. They are the Nile or Black Tilapia, Blue Tilapia, and Mozambique or Red Tilapia. Nile Tilapia are dark gray or black with distinct regular dark stripes and reach maturity after five to seven months at roughly one to two pounds. Blue tilapia, which are often blue-gray with a pink-white belly, take longer to mature and commonly reach two to four pounds within three years. Mozambique tilapia have an olive-gray tone and yellow belly, while the red variety ranges from an almost translucent white body to an orange-red body color. The head and fins are usually red in both cases. They are seen as an attractive food fish option due to their close resemblance to popular marine species such as red snapper and are becoming very popular. Mozambique tilapia can reach over two pounds in one year. Of course, all tilapia are capable of reaching larger weights. Tilapia are vegetarian, feeding on aquatic plants and algae in the wild. On farms, they are raised in lakes, ponds, or tanks, and fed a commercial feed, which usually relies heavily on corn and soybeans. Indoor tanks are used exclusively where temperatures are too low for breeding and rearing. Tilapia can tolerate very high stocking densities. Female tilapia mouth brood their fry. That is, they lay unfertilized eggs on the bed of the lake or tank, which are then fertilized by a male and the female returns and scoops the eggs into her mouth, where she broods them until after they hatch. Growing tilapia is becoming popular with homesteaders and people seeking food security because they are easy and effective to raise, especially combined with vegetable production in aquaponic systems. Tilapia is the fourth most commonly consumed type of seafood in the United States, after shrimp, salmon, and tuna. Customers enjoy tilapia because it is relatively affordable and doesn't taste fishy. Tilapia is available almost everywhere, either fresh or frozen. If you enjoyed this video, 
please subscribe, like, and share. Don't forget to click on the bell icon so that you'll be notified whenever a new video is posted.